So here we are at the uh, world famous Ribble Head Railway Station. You can just see, this is the station up on the moor and if Doug pans to the right, you can actually see the viaduct that's very famous. Um, it's quite a bleak day, but great to be up here. And then behind us here, we've got, there's still a couple of sidings for coal and a little waiting room. And then Doug will do some shots of the station and the viaduct and he'll add to these. So just a little video of us saying, well, we're here. <laughs> it is a bit bleak up here as well, though. It's in the middle of nowhere. Difficult to know who ever got on the station here. Um, but there you go. It's quite an iconic little station building, that. And of course, we're only a few miles from Dent, which is the highest station on the British Railway network. So this is just um, a quick video, an update, because we haven't done one for a while, because as you can see, we're on holiday. Um, so Doug will try and get this up tonight, just to say, uh, don't forget, we, uh, we haven't stopped making them. Uh, we're just a bit busy doing other things at the moment. Um, and Doug will get a bit more film and uh, we'll all speak to you again soon. Um, and we're going to do a bit of the settle to Carlisle up to Kirby Stephen, Kirby Stephen. And as you can see, this is all the typical architecture. This one's a bit um, boarded up, but we'll get some film on the way uh, and Doug will do a load of film. But this is the iconic settle to Carlisle railway. So I'm quite excited to be going on this, having seen it in books for years, particularly Blaymore and Dent. It's going to be great to see the, uh, the actual line.
Hi, thanks for watching the video and for the nice comments. Uh, click on the left for a previous video in this series. Click on the right for another video you might enjoy. And please don't forget to click to subscribe, like, comment, etc. Thanks again.